Okay, hello dear friends. So this one we will do some polynomial uh, long division. So here is the question x to the power of 3 minus 2x to the power of 2 minus 3x plus 12 divided by x plus 2. Just in case, if you are curious, this is a, a Lamy pen. I got one friend asking if this is a Lamy pen. Oh, it's broken. I must have stepped on it. It's been a long time. Anyway, <clears throat> so there is nothing that really um, complicate the logic and method is actually quite simple same as the division of numbers you treat each of these as a place value each degree of the variable as um, as um, as a place value so here is x plus 2 divided by x plus 2 we copy this one as the division form so here some some people likes to write on the first i like to write on the on the one degree below the top degree the highest degree and based on the the natural number here based on the integer the constant here okay so x plus 2 to the power of 1 what can we do to make it to the power of 3 then is x square to the power of 3 and the the coefficient here is 1 the coefficient here is 1 so x square is good enough you do not need to do any other number on top of it Okay, x times x squared is x cubed plus 2 times x squared is 2x squared and the, the, the sign here is plus sign, is a positive sign, so the first minus the second is actually the same as uh, as long division. You minus this. So this minus this becomes 0x cubed minus x cubed is 0. 2x squared minus 2x squared is negative 4x squared minus 3x so here what do we do and with which number we time to get x is the same to to make x the same to time how many to make it the same so we need to time negative 4x so that this and uh, so that this number could be uh, deducted so x times 4 x is negative 4 x square minus 8 x right now we <coughs> minus it we subtract it becomes 0 3 minus negative 8 then be becomes positive 5x plus 12 here what do we do we will do a positive 5 so 5x plus 10 becomes 2 right Okay, the remainder is 2. 
So we can write this one, this equation equal to x square minus 4x plus 5 and the remainder plus remainder is positive 2, right? So x plus 2 and on top is 2. So 2 over x plus 2. So this is the result. Okay, we will do another one just to make us a bit more uh, fluent on this. I will copy x cube minus 4x square minus 19x plus 9 divided by x plus 3. I write it slowly because our brain needs time to process. Sometimes when I, in, when I am in class, um, I have a habit or I make sure I write down everything. And if we do not write down, sometimes the student does not catch it and then they will miss it. And that is not good. We do not want to do that. We want to catch up with everything. So here we do x square. x square times x plus 3 is x cube plus 3x square. Right? So 4 minus 3 is negative 7x square minus 19x and this one we need to get to negative 7x right negative 7x square so that here we can deduct it and minus 21x 7 times 3 is 21 the sign is negative and uh, two, 19, negative 19 minus negative 21 is plus 21. So it's 2x plus 9. So plus 2, 2x plus 6. And the remainder is 3. So... The result is x cubed minus 4x squared minus 19x plus 9 divided by x plus 3 equal to x squared minus 7x plus 2 plus 3 over x plus 3. This is the remainder of it. How many minutes we got? We got 8 minutes. So maybe we will do another one a little bit more complicated. I have never tried. We are in 8.20. So let me just give it a try and see if I can do it. Okay. So x cube plus 3x square plus 3x plus 1 divided by x square plus 2x plus 1. The method should be the same. So let's do it. So here I will put it here. So I x squared times x is x to the power of 3. You make sure first you get rid of uh, x cubes, the highest degree, so that you, 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 you deduct it. You cancel it out, deduct it, uh, subtract it. 
Okay, get rid of uh, the highest degree and uh, plus 2x squared plus 2 plus 1x equal to and now we will do the deduction so x squared plus 2x plus 1 plus 1 so what we are going to see the most important is to make sure this coefficient this uh, constant times a certain number this number times um, the, the 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 divider makes makes this difference disappear so x square plus 2x plus 1 oh the remainder is 0 so we can say x to the power of 3 plus 3 x square plus 3 x plus 1 divided by x square plus 2x plus 1 equal to this is product this is the co quotient 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 x plus 1 we are done with it easy peasy lemon squeezy right okay let's see if we need to do oh this one is kind of interesting okay x to the power of 4 plus x square plus 1 uh-uh, uh-uh, not so early. Okay, we will do like this. X to the power of 4 plus... Okay, let me copy the problem first x to the power of 4 plus x squared plus 1 divided by x squared plus x plus 1. So we make sure each degree 0 uh, 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 to the power uh, uh, cube, the coefficient is 0. So we write it down plus x squared plus 0 times x plus 1 divided by x squared plus x plus 1. Okay, so here we do x squared is x squared x cubed plus uh, x to the power of 3 plus x square negative x square cube plus zero plus zero x cube now this one we will minus x minus x cube minus x square minus x so this one deduct and this one become positive x square and this one becomes positive x plus one oh, oh we are one x square plus x plus 1 so we got the result the result I do not have time to write it down the result is x square minus x plus 1 
Thank you very, very, very much. I enjoyed doing this.